Hello, good day friend. Today we'll see how we can attach a new data disk to an Azure virtual machine. So let us see this in action. So I'm here in Azure virtual machine section. Let me create a new virtual machine. Uh, let me create a resource group. Test. Okay, now virtual machine name. Maybe I can give you test vm1 let it be on its us uh, this is let me take windows so that i can show it to you uh, yes let it let me take a spot instance so that yeah that's perfect and then username let me put it okay so yeah, next the standard drive disk so i don't have any data disk here okay so after i create the virtual machine i'll attach a data disk to the virtual machine so next networking everything will be same uh, as we do when you create a virtual machine okay yeah, so review and create click on create so let the virtual machine be created okay the virtual machine got created so uh, if you come left hand side settings disk you will be seeing there is a waste disk but there is no data disk okay so we'll be creating one new data disk uh, before we do that let me log into the virtual machine Okay, so we have logged in. Let me open the Explorer. So I'm inside this PC and you see there is no disk available. Okay, so let me log in and let me sign out and add a new disk. Okay, so to add a new disk, first of all, you stop the virtual machine. Okay, and then right. So I will go to disk and then I will create a create and attach a new disk. So you can select the level and then disk name. Let me give it disk one. Uh, let me make it standard hard drive disk. You can uh, select the size. Okay. Mm, so if it is, if you put more, sorry, uh, maybe more. Okay. okay, as you need. So for I, I will just go with uh, maybe thirty two is perfect for me. Okay, and encryption you can make it by platform managed key platform managed means the key will be managed by microsoft okay and then if you click on save okay it is saved now let me go to overview and start the virtual machine okay the virtual machine is started let me copy the ip and let me go and log in into the virtual machine So I'm inside um, this uh, explorer. If you go to this PC, you still don't see the drive. So that's why if we if we go to disk management, okay, uh, you see this prompt. Okay, click on OK, and once you click on OK, expand it, and you come down. Once you are you will be seeing dix2 this one unallocated right click on it click on new simple volume click on next okay uh, you can allocate the size you can part partition it if you want click on next uh, assign a later next and then next and let's finish okay so it's now ready you close this one and you see this volume is here okay let us see when the virtual machine is running can we associate a data disk with a virtual machine okay so let me uh, go to disk again 
and create and attach a new disk uh, this is the next disk disk 2 okay this is standard hdd same 32 and let me click on save so this created the uh, disk and let me go to virtual machine now we don't see as usual and if we go to disk uh, hard disk partitions and we see disk 3 click on ok and you can expand it you can come down and you can see the second disk and you have to follow the same process okay so it's formatting and it's ready so if we close this and you, your disk is ready thank you for watching this